Tottenham against Manchester United. Stay with us for live coverage right here on EA TV. And hello, wherever you're watching, welcome to North London. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary position by Lee Dixon. And we have live action from the FA Cup to bring you today. It is Tottenham Hotspur taking on Manchester United. Well, I do love my league football, but when I was a player, I looked forward to cup competitions. That road to the final starts with games like this. It's going to be a cracker. Nerves as well. You don't want to get knocked out at this stage. Number 15, Eric. Edinson Cavani, whenever he's on the pitch, is a man you have to take seriously. What sort of game do you expect from Cavani today? Well, he's added goals to his wizardry. Will he get another goal today? A brace in his last match. Number seven, Hong Min Song. And number ten, Harry Kane. Introducing the Spurs starting 11. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. This is the team Manchester United Thank will you. go with. David De Gea between the posts. Eric Bailly plays alongside Victor Lindelof in central defence. And potentially a real handful in attack today. Edinson Cavani. A potentially riveting 90 minutes in front of us. Tottenham Hotspur with the kickoff. Fabier. Now Harry Kane. Losing possession here. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes. Cavani. Big chance. And rifled against the post, but back in play. And he could be in proper trouble here. Might be dangerous. Rashford. Oh, he saved it well. And United have the corner. Played into the centre of the box. Has he got a score? It might be on for them. Disappointing pass. Good looking sequence. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Bale. He's in with a chance. And a goal! One nil! It is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And how strong was he here? Incredible to hold off the defenders and get his shot away. Lovely goal. Underway again, and Tottenham with the advantage. Fabier. Hey, 
And Hoybier with it. Now Harry Kane. Couldn't keep the ball, Bale. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they take advantage? And he's through here. Doing the stifling, Toby Alderweireld. Alderweireld. Bale. Here's Ndombele. A Spurs free kick it's going to be. Well, that could be his final rebuke, I think, and the referee's making that absolutely clear. Well, I like that, Derek. Good refereeing. Nice and strong. Told the player exactly what he was thinking. from long range he didn't miss by much Lee no I thought the ball would be coming into the box but long range free kick he's had a go Alex Tellez has it United enjoying the bulk of possession here but they have to create more they have to be more positive the final third play has been slow, too predictable. Rashford. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And the offence sufficiently sinister to warrant a yellow card. Yes, agree with that one, Derek. He's got to be careful now. Well, certainly he looks surprised that's a yellow. Well, straight into the meat of the penalty area. Ndombele. And, and beyond the last defender, offside. Given away by Tottenham. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Intelligent threaded pass here. Routine stop for De Gea to make. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. Bruno Fernandes. Greenwood. Half time then here in the English Cup. underway then and work to do for United given the scoreline tremendous challenge oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily Cavani Rashford on to Bruno Fernandes Oh, great defending. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, Derek, you're right. He has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. Well, they no longer have the ball. Could be a chance to break here. Bale, and the counter-attack came to nothing. Bruno Fernandes. Alex Tellez. Clean 
challenge. Promising looking ball. The end product just wasn't there. Rashford. Chance to cross. Had to come up with the ball and did. Tottenham have not had too much of the ball, but to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit you on the break, and it's really working for this team. Cavani. Bruno Fernandes has it. Possession seeded by United. Lindelof. Kane and unable to keep the ball well let's see what they have in store for them on the break and it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes Kane and here's Dombele well that is a defender's job to come to the rescue a good looking move it's going to be United's free kick Here's a change for Manchester United. Paul Pogba. Over the top towards Rashford. They're showing a willingness to attack as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. Edinson Cavani's in the vicinity. And he did what he had to do defensively. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they keep it going? Dombele going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. He's found a pocket of space. Chances on. And caught with ease. No real threat from the cross. Well, these Tottenham supporters have been a real driving force on the team's performance today. Can they push them over the line? And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Bruno Fernandes, Donny van der Beek, he's enjoying space on the attack in the closing phase. And you need your defender to take charge. The final whistle then, and Spurs move on. Yeah, only just there it was, Nick, but it was a good performance, really good game to watch as well, I really enjoyed that. Just edged it in all departments in the end, the coach will be really happy. final analysis a really positive